Hey guys, welcome to a new episode of Just Rolled In. This vehicle came in because the check engine light is on, which was caused by a malfunction in camshaft variator. Upon inspection, the mechanic found the engine oil to be like this, and was later told by the customer they haven't changed the engine oil in 60,000 miles. And this truck came in because the customer needs it to pass an emissions inspection. The mechanic said this is just a few of the things they found wrong with this truck, but the customer didn't want any of the other issues they found fixed and said he will just bring it to another shop. Customer states there's a pine cone smell inside the cab of their truck. The customer told the mechanic they've had their truck parked for the past year and never bothered to check under the hood. Smokey the Bear says, only you can prevent door jam fires. Customer states their truck has a lack of power and no brakes. The customer drove it 30 minutes to the shop with only using his parking brake to stop. The technician said the truck had a bad distributor which caused the engine to backfire and then resulted in the brake booster exploding. This customer's Mustang GT500 hasn't had an oil change in over 47,000 miles. This Mustang initially came in to get a new clutch installed, and the mechanic said it's had more clutches than oil changes. This customer's vehicle was towed in because they ran out of gas. The mechanic found out that the customer tried filling the coolant reservoir with gasoline. Customer states four-wheel drive isn't working on the truck they just bought. The mechanic checked the VIN and found the truck to only be a two-wheel drive model and thinks that the previous owner just did a solid front axle swap. This customer's concern was that their taillights don't turn on, but the customer didn't mention they only had one headlight that kind of worked. Customer states remote key doesn't work even with a new battery. This 2019 Jeep Wrangler came in because it has no communication with the PCM and it won't start. It was caused by loose terminals in a two-way connector in a network connector block. Another dealership had replaced a body control module, two security gateway modules, and a network connector block, which never fixed the issue. The mechanic who shared this clip said this is the most interesting and toxic thing he has seen in a customer's vehicle. The guy on his bike was okay and he rode his bike back home. I hope you enjoyed this video and please consider leaving a like and subscribing. You can also submit your clips at justrolledinyt.com. Thanks for watching.